Right, now in this video we've got the Type-C 3.0 charging cables from Orsley. Now in this video we're going to take a look at these cables, but we're also going to test them with the brand new Lexus 6P. I'll also show you how you can test your Type-C charging cables with this device. Now we know there's many Type-C cables available online, many of them are not actually compliant with the Type-C specification, and that's because they're fitted with the incorrect resistor. Now what that resistor is doing is it's pulling more voltage from the power adapter or your laptop depending on where you're charging your device, and pulling more voltage than needs to, you're potentially damaging your power adapter, your laptop, or even your mobile device. Now these Type-C cables from all that I'm going to be demonstrating in this video are 100% compliant. They've got the correct 56K resistor in the Type-C end, so they will be safe to use your mobile device and your laptops. Now in this video, I'm going to show you a free app that you can download from the Google Play Store on how to test the Type-C charging cable with your mobile device. Now the app that I'm using is called Current Monitor. It's free to download from the Google Play Store. Now on the app, what you're looking for when you do plug the cable in is a section here called Type-C device slash current detect. If it's 2, it means the cable is not compliant. If it's 0, it means the cable is compliant with the device and the Type-C specifications. So for this test, I'm just going to plug the Type-C cable into this power adapter. So this is before I plug the Type-C cable into the Nexus 6P. Now when I do plug it in, as mentioned, this bottom section here, which is Type-C device slash current detect, should remain 0 to show that it is compliant with this device. Now I have plugged it in. You can see there's small changes in the settings. So you can see it's charging. Charge type is fast, and at the bottom you can see the Type C device current detect is still at zero, showing that it is compliant with the Type C specifications. So with that, it's a quick way to prove and check the cable, see if they are Type C compliant and safe to use with your mobile device and your adapters. Of course, you're looking for that zero on the Type C device. So that's a quick video guide on how to test your Type C charging cable, and also just to show you that the Type C cables from Orsley are compliant with your Type C compatible device. Now these cables from Orsley are available in a variety of colours in this 1 meter length as well as the black. We've also got these cables in a special 4 pack as well so they're perfect if you are someone that loses cables or wants spare cables to keep at home, the office or even on the move they come in 4 different colours inside of this great value pack. That's the Orsley 3.0 Type-C charging cable. Now while it's charging you can also use these for data transfer as well so you can connect your device to your laptop or computer to transfer data such as images, pictures and videos. Visit Aussie.com for more information about our Type-C cables. We'll also view our test certificate on these cables as well to show that they are Type-C specification compliant. Now the Nexus 6P is just one device that is Type-C compatible. Check out our YouTube channel and subscribe to it as well. well. Over the next few days we'll be doing more videos of devices that are Type-C compatible and testing them with the Aussie 3.0 Type-C cables. So do check that out and of course don't to like and subscribe to us on YouTube and on Facebook for more videos. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again in the next video.